I promise we will always stay together, Maxie. <laughs> I promise to always love you, Ren. Don't go out too far. I'm fine. Okay, if you say so. Maxie? Maxie, where are you? Come on, this isn't funny. Are you hiding? Come out already. Hold on! Are you okay? I'm okay. I told you, but you didn't listen to me. I'm sorry. It's alright. I forgive you. Yeah? School! Hurry and eat your breakfast! Coming. Hi again. It's me, Max. I'm just a girl who thought the world was such a colorful place. A girl who loved to look at the stars, to play in the rain, go on adventures, and have the biggest imagination. I never understood why people leave our lives. I wanted to believe that everything was okay and be positive all the time. I wanted to go back to how things were, but we all grow up at one point whether we want to or not, and we can't change that. Hey, be careful, all right, sport? Dad, I'll be fine. Have a good day, Maxie. Yeah, yeah. Be safe. I got it, Dad. Wonderful of you to join me. Hey, I had a situation, alright? With? I couldn't get out of bed. Sounds like me every day. Yeah, but you don't have to forcibly, like, roll yourself out of bed to get up, so... I mean, that just sounds like it hurts. Oh, it does.
Does Jane know her? Hmm, I think so. She may have brought it up before, but knowing me, I just forgot everything, so... Hmm. Alex! Jane! What is it this time? Just thought I'd come say hello to the freak of the school. I don't feel like talking to the school's queen. So... What got into her cereal this morning? Maya! What? Um, nothing. She's insane, I swear. Why do you talk to her then? I don't. I just want to say hi. Allison, where have you been? Studying. Duh. As always, Allison. What? Some of us actually want to get good grades and, you know, go to college? Sounds boring. All right, class, settle down. Mmm, hello. Jane! What? Oh my god. I'm your new teacher for this semester. Miss Ryer has reassigned me, so you're all stuck with me. Fine by me. Lord, help this child. He didn't notice, right? Oh lord. Please, please. Huh? Where did he go? How nice of you to join us, Mr. Meyer. Hmm. We're in the same class? <sighs> My life. Ugh. Again? Every single day. You're dead to me. What? Do you know what my teacher said to the homework you gave me? N no I got a D minus. You're supposed to give me good grades, not disappointment. I'm sorry, I didn't do it on purpose. I'll do better next time. You better, or I swear I'll make your life a living hell. I'm already in hell. Just you wait. Back off, would ya? Oh, here we go again. What did I tell you last time, nerd? It's none of your business. It is my business when it bothers me. You're disturbing another student, not just that, but bullying her into doing something that you can't even do yourself. Because you don't study like the rest of us. Max, why don't you do us all a favor and go back into your little imaginary world? <laughs> okay? Great. You know, you're lucky that the school has rules. Why does that make me lucky? Otherwise, I would have just punched you right here, right now. Max, just leave. Savannah, she- It's none of your business! Sav, leave it be! I don't need your help! What happened? I just got yelled at by Savannah for trying to help her. She's just being stubborn. Yeah, but... Just leave it be. When she needs the help, she'll come to us. I sure hope so. What, uh, what you doing? Holy hell! Where did you come from? Chill, chill. What's got you so worked up? You just scared me to death, that's what. What you watching? Nothing. Really? What? She's good, that's all. Mm-hmm, yeah, okay. Ollie, do you like... I have a thing for Maya? What? Who, me? Yes, you. No. Casper the little lonely goes who haunts these hallways. Yes, you, you idiot! I don't know what you're talking about. 
You know exactly what I'm talking about. I don't like her like that. Okay, whatever you say. Ellie. Huh? What you doing? Nothing. Mm-hmm. Hi, Ellie. Allison. Well, I'm going home, so bye, bro. See ya, man. See ya, Ollie. Ouch! Watch where you're going. I, uh, <laughs> sorry. Weirdo. Gah, why are you so awkward? talked in what 10 years I know you can hear me Ren why have you been ignoring me this entire time there's so many questions I've wanted to ask you but haven't do you want the truth Maxine yes yes I've been ignoring you this entire time I don't need you in my life, nor do I want you in it. How hard is that to understand? That's what I thought. He was never this cold to me, ever. He was my best friend, and I know who Ren is. The real him. And I can tell when he's lying to me. 